you didn't hear this from me, but those ecliptic mercenaries, the fact you see the hell with you're that? making things harder for yourself. You see security. You're under arrest. I've got special orders. You're coming with me. Prepare for immediate transport to our vessel. <laughs> Smart decision. Stand by to be transferred. I'm telling you, the commander's got plans for this loser. Why else would he be going through all this trouble? I still don't understand why he trusts the criminal. Seems like too much of a risk. Stop worrying and keep an eye on our guest. I'll be right back. You just sit tight. The commander wants to have a little chat. The prisoner is ready, sir. Discuss. Hmm. Highly perceptive. Let me add that to your list of skills. Speaking of which, let's see what we're working with here. Hmm. It appears that you have a background in cyber running. <coughs> Perfect. Information gathering is one of our top priorities around here. I also see that you have mined on Vectera. And now you're with Constellation. You've certainly been quite busy. Oh, and look at that. Right at the bottom of this list is the criminal incident that landed you in my crosshairs. Good. You'll find that I'm a stickler for details, and I'd hate to discover that your file is incomplete. Now that we have that out of the way, let me introduce myself. My name is Commander Kibwe Ikande, and I'm in charge of this operation for UC Sysdev. Are you familiar with what we do? Yes, well, this is your only opportunity to keep yourself out of jail. So I suggest you change your attitude. UC Sysdev is a division of the UC Navy. Well, they <laughs> handle the big picture stuff. We deal with a very particular problem. The Crimson Fleet. That convict is where you enter the picture. I don't remember asking how you felt about anything. We've been prodding at the Crimson Fleet for years, trying to take them down one ship at a time. But we barely scratched the surface. If we can get someone on the inside, we have a shot at finding a loose thread we can pull to bring it all down. That's where you and I differ. As a citizen of the United Colonies, I accept my responsibilities. You, on the other hand, clearly couldn't give a damn. Look, I'm going to make this simple. Agree to work for UC Sysdev, and together we take down the Crimson Fleet. Refuse, and I tell these guys to throw you into the nearest lockup. Might even tack on an extra few hundred credits to your fine. <laughs> when you broke the law, you forfeited your rights. So basically, I can do whatever the hell I want. So, what do you say? You going to work with me, or should I find someone else? Suit yourself. You know, I have to admit, I'm a bit surprised. My instincts told me you were the right person, but I suppose I was wrong. All right, send this one to the lockup on Sidonia. Let them deal with the problem.
something suspicious. What's up? <coughs> Excuse me. You look hurt. Might want to head Hey. I want to talk to you for a second. Some friends of mine heard how you handled Sistef. They, uh... One a word. No point. I've got nothing else to say. Everything you need to know is right here. Take it. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Unless you're here to serve me a drink, you can turn around and walk away. Well, well, if it isn't Neva's little hero. So, you're the hotshot that turned down Sistef's offer, huh? You don't look that impressive to me. Whoa! <laughs> okay, killer, calm down. If you think that Slate was some kind of a free pass into our organization, <laughs> you're wrong. But keep your head down and your mouth shut, and you might just get a crack at some real money. Yeah, I kind of thought that'd make you shut up and listen. Neva told me to make sure you've got what it takes to run with us, and I'll be damned if I'm going to let her down. That means before I send you to meet her, you need to do a little job for me first. Right down to business and no small talk. I like it. Now listen up, because I'm not going to repeat myself. I need you to deal with a miner who's racked up a bunch of debt. He probably spent it all on booze, not that I blame him. Either way, I want that money back. Perfect. His name's Carl Fielding. I think you'll find him wandering around the Deimos Miners' quarters. Don't worry, you can't miss him. Just look for the most miserable-looking guy in the entire place. Things can get pretty glum around here. And any injuries or mistakes you incur while suffering the effects of overwork or exhaustion can also harm your company's bottom line. Many stories and films about demons. Watch out for the robot. Something I can help you with? <coughs> Art like camp. Who the heck is that? 
Adler, you said? Uh, nope. I think you have me mixed up with someone else. <laughs> uh, look, I'm tired. It's been a long day in the mines. I just want to go home, wash off the dust, and relax. This has been fun, though. Whatever. Uh, hey, hey, now. <laughs> Take it easy there. Let me think about that person you mentioned. Uh, Adler, was it? Hmm? Oh, wait. You mean that Adler? Yeah, sorry. I, I thought you were talking about someone else. I told him I'd pay up next week when Deimos cuts our next profit share check. I'll even bring it to him personally. <laughs> Sound good? Yeah? Come on! Give me a break! What the... Look, I haven't got a single credit to spare right now. Okay? You can't squeeze blood from a stone. You know? Right? Oh, what games? Why are you doing this to me? I don't have the money. Uh, that's what I'm hoping. I'm glad you understand the position I'm in here. What? No, that's not true. I know, I know Adler's paying you to lean on me. So, you're just doing your job. But I swear, I've got nothing left, okay? If I give you the last of my credits, my family starves. I can't afford to do that. <coughs> I won't do that. Holy crap! Really? You'd do that for me? Wow! I don't even know what to say. Thank you. For everything. And don't worry. I'll never borrow anything from Adler again. I promise. Only I don't care what anyone says. This is still a tough assignment. Am I glad I got this job instead of mine? Have something for me? There, would you look at that? I knew that bum was holding out on me. He going to be a problem anymore? Or did he get the message? Nice, nice! You're kind of a natural at this. Leaning on deadbeats comes easy to you. I like that. Well, looks like you've made it this far. Take one more step and there's no going back. You still think you can handle running with my associates? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I like your style. All right, I'm convinced. <laughs> I'll call ahead and get a hold of Neva. Head out to Europa, you'll find her there. I suggest you listen to whatever she has to say. 